Hello there, this is Mr. Fingers and Talking Hands from Bad English Tricks. And again, it's a cutting time. Again and again. I don't know when it was last time. <clears throat> but I found something for nice price from Fratchi. No, I mean Swart Records. Swart is uh, Swedish uh, and it means black. And so let's do this. And from here, this is surprising art oh, because there's a camera between us. So let's see what there is, and there it is. Tarot. Uh, some people might know uh, tarot, also uh, outside of Finland, but originally. Uh, it's uh, from 80s and now they are coming, I don't know, are they coming back, but they did one uh, geek and now they are having a geeks again uh, at some festivals uh, next summer, so that's really nice. If I remember right, it was festival geeks. And uh, some people might know Nightwish, and there used to be, uh, as a bass player, Tarot's uh, vocalist, Marko Hiatala. Uh, he's not anymore in the band, uh, he left the band, uh, but there it is. It's not a hair metal, <laughs> even though it might look. Uh, at least not for me. Of course, like I said, it's from 80s and um, but Marco Hietala is a really good vocalist. Um, when Bruce Dickinson left uh, Iron Maiden, um, he would have been better to do that. Uh, he wasn't, uh, I, I think he wasn't trying to get in the band um, but there was rumors, uh, but I guess there's, there are, they are false news. And this is now repressed by Levuka by X Record Store X. Uh, if I understood right from the sticker, Black Heaven. At least there was a sticker. A limited red vinyl edition available exclusive from Elevi Kappa Axe and I bought it from Swart Records. Uh, there wasn't anything bonus stuff. This is um, Kuuntele Kovalla. Play hard. Loud. loud. This is a Swart release. Uh, this is uh, Tehosekoitin. Köyhät syntiset. Mm. Uh, rock band um, that sounded quite punk also in early day. I think they also were kind of punk early early days. But then they started doing different kind of things. There was a blues black vinyl, and there was a. Uh, Schlager music and disco and that kind of this is their second album so young young dudes last year I went to see their last gig let's see will it be I hope they're coming come later to do again last gig oh there's a comics inside this is something that I haven't, don't have also in, uh, on CD, so it's nice to have. There it is, black vinyl, and this fun uh, poster, uh, this from 97, this is uh, Tehosekoitin, Hyper Children, Apulanta, and 69 Eyes uh, on the same tour. Uh, same here. And there's some else. Some people might know 
69s also from outside Finland and hybrid children is also if you like ro nice rock music uh, heavier rock music uh, you might like them also <clears throat> uh, what would I recommend well video that you can find from YouTube I guess is uh, come on baby yeah it's a uh, it's a big hit uh, but I liked from many of those these songs uh, one of the songs that I uh, like is Veri Vetä Muo eh, oh sorry Veri Vetä Eteenpäin really nicely done cover though so this, this is fun because this is, isn't so yeah well anyway from here maybe Follow me into madness. Right now, I don't remember uh, the song so well. Uh, so, I have some other tarot albums, but never had this one, so I bought it. It was kind of okay price. This was really cheap, only 10 euros. And this was under 20. So, that's why I bought them. And this is now I have. I think I have now everything that the Jose Godin has released. But couple on vinyl and less other ones on CD. Bye bye.